Wake the fuck up, samurai. We have a city to burn. Expecting us to get ambushed. Left a few peeps behind at the airstrip. Rest went with Hellman. I would have done the same. They're looking to call their people. The last they want is to ride through the desert without backup. I hope Mitch contacted the Alder Keldos. All that damn interference. They're coming for him. Don't worry. You know what? What? Oh, you bitch! The fuck, Pan Am? She just ran into me. Vantage point, indeed. I guess we're fighting. We'll turn that off first. It's a lot of them. Oh, oh, I don't know. All right. Whoa! Let's go behind. Got him. Nice. He's really going for it. I'm in. Helmet, he has to be here. Man, imagine if I killed Helmet by mistake. Hopefully, some of these give me bullets. Hmm. 
All right, Halbin, show yourself. You literally cannot win. Have you seen what I've done to the people outside? Hello. Just remember, you have Hellman, and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something with it. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just biz. He's no friend of yours. Hey. Takamura, good news. Got Hellman. Alive. What did he say? Alive, alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Come on, buddy. You're Better coming with me. Somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Looks like you're in sure. Holy shit! Is that him? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Wow. You're floating. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder colors. <coughs> the road was clear. I don't think we were A spotted. few? We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Long story. Jeez, long story. Not sure I'd even know where to start. Tell me next time then. Hello? So everything's done here. All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope he was worth it. It's all I tried to raise Scorpion. Maybe I could help out somehow. I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Look at this badass. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Wasn't his wasn't her fault. It really wasn't Pan Am's fault. Careful. You and me are not buddy buddy. Besides, nobody's blamed anyone for anything. We are not buddy buddy, that's right. Right. Pan Am was just helping me. It was my doing. My fault that AV got hit. Without me, Scorpion and his people wouldn't have gone out to grab it. That's the truth. When you're in Aldo Caldo, you are always responsible for yourself and your people. The circumstances change nothing. Perhaps Pan Am should ask herself if she's still in Alder Caldo. Damn it all. Don't worry about it, hey, Don't worry about Saul. He'll get over it. I don't give a damn. But he gives a damn about you, Pan Am. As soon as he heard what had happened, he ordered us to follow you. He was worried something would happen. Saul? That was his? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but your family and Saul will do anything for family. Is this a Fast and Furious film? What the, the hell? Thing is, am I even part of the family anymore? You know you are. Come back to us. <laughs> I understand. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get complicated. Dramatic sometimes. But I will manage. And you, you look out for yourself, all right? What do you do now? So, what now? Back to Night City? Yeah. I mean, I think so. I what do you mean you think so? About everything. Uh huh. All right. 
Maybe you should talk to Saul. Saul, Mitch, they really treat you like family. Maybe you should give them a chance. It is not that simple. Like any family. They're coming. You have about a minute to get out of there. Let's move. I'm also headed out. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours. Well. I guess I got a new bike, even though I probably won't be using it very often. Uh, shit. Hello, buddy. Hey. Where am I? What is this place? It's a motel in the middle of nowhere, let's be nowhere. very honest. Any specific middle? Doesn't matter. You're not leaving here by yourself anyway. Why are we here? Uh, want to talk about the little biochip in my head? talk about your little invention. Biochip you made for Arasaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. Um. You got a problem, you're gonna help me kick it. Nobody sent me. I got a problem, and you're gonna help me. And what does that have to do with the biochip? Uh, you. Got Silverhand's construct literally in my head. Got Silverhand's construct in my head. It's literally driving me crazy, and I know it's only gonna get worse. That is, unless I remove it. And that, none of that's on the billboards I saw. Not even in the fine print. Construct, that's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Uh, it's a very long story. Long story. If Arisaka finds me, I'm dead. So are you. So we are in no hurry. And I'm interested, truly. Stole it from Collected Yorinobu. Off Yorinobu Arisaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out. And of you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arisaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. Gotta remove the biochip from my system then. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. And I know you, you can't just don't, you can't just like, pull it out. I know you can't just yank it out. My you said, showed that to some fucking street doctor? Who else knows? I needed help. Or did you think the first thing that came to mind was down in a Kang Tao AV? How is that different from the normal one? How's Tell the me. prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more Aware. aggressive. The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved And it was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. Okay. How is that supposed How to work exactly? How exactly is this new version supposed to work? Were you planning to have the engram kick people out of their own bodies? Is that oh, shit someone's by coming design? in. During the tests, we assumed that the body would be... Neurally indifferent during implantation. You mean dead? Yes, which makes what happened to you interesting indeed. Who could afford this version then? How do you put a price on immortality? Who could even afford tech like this? Nobody. This model was meant to remain in house. The prototype was Saburo Arisaka's personal commission. He oversaw the entire project himself. So if it weren't for Yorinobu, Nobody would have found out. And if not for you, the project would not have been a success. I hear a cat this is somewhere. A true breakthrough. Dude, your tech works. Congrats. Get yeah, it out. Great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. 
Don't really trust you, buddy. Whoa, we just met. Haven't built up that sort of trust yet. How did you think this was going to go? If you want me to help you, I must examine you. Fine, okay. Looks like can't believe this suit's the one who's gonna help us. I can't either. You know what, Johnny? Crazy. Oh, fuck. All right, was it? What? What is it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing I could Woo -hoo, do it's bargaining time. is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. You said the project was in its trial phase. Wait, you said the project was in the trial phase? You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. At all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against this. So no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. And from what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into Arasaka legend. Alright, tell me what's gonna happen. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? I don't know. I've got because one and the other like one is not me. Voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand simultaneously. I'm not here to talk about philosophy. Uh, you know what? Let's tell him. I can see him and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the construct's influence on your decision making? Sheesh, give it a rest. He can't actually make me do anything. When it comes to my decisions, Johnny really is just a voice in my head. Maybe he has a different opinion, but he can't make me do anything. Agreed 100%. You are one fucking stubborn. It's not as if one of you wins. Shut up, Johnny. Debate. The scale simply shifts, slowly but surely. What do you mean? What do you mean? You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomb. Well, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to consider clinical isolation at this stage. At least Johnny never made a whore of himself. At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking now? Ooh. Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny. Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. All right, enough of this. You know what? That's enough. You just playing for time, because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? Because I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you if you come with me to Kangtao. I'll try. That's not really cut it, buddy. You, you must say I, I will help you. I'll try. Just isn't gonna cut it. Actually, it's almost like you're trying to buy your way in with the Chinese. At my expense. Do you even realize how much data is in your head? Even if I can't help you, the data must be saved. Well, fuck me sideways. What a half brain gonk. You just admitted you're right. Forget Kang Tao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gonk's fucking useless without him. He. Hello, Takimura. Takimura. What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice, he might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints. Now. Thank you. Man, how many slots do I have? Thank you. Fatal damage. As long as we find someone fluent in techno battle. Yeah. 
<laughs> what are you what doing? Do with him? I haven't decided yet. Are you serious? You know me. I can be impulsive. Okay, I'll just go. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I'm freaking out I anyway. Hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is positively parched. Fuck. Oh no, don't fall into the texture. Sons of bitches. Omega, no. Uh, that's what you are. You really are paranoid. You don't see it. Way corpses are stripped at our world and lives naked, piece by piece. Can't turn a blind eye to that. Why are we talking about this? Whatever you gotta say, say it. Got something eating at your code. That's clear. Been trying to learn how you're wired this whole time. To know who I'm dealing with. Thought you were just unlucky at first, but I kept watching and finally realized what your problem is. Oh yeah, go on. You were a kid from the Badlands. Family was your crutch and c But in NC, you're nobody. Best you can do is steal from scavs, the merc janitors. You seem to know a lot about me. You know a lot about my past. Well, seeing flashes of your past, just like you've seen flashes of mine. Eh, scared out. Why can't you just leave me alone, buddy? Don't think I care. What does interest me is why you're a clingy creep. I think we can work together, V. But your plans make no sense. Destroy Arisaka. I, I don't even know what that means. All in good time. You've got no idea what you want. As I see it, you don't know what you really want. So you concocted the boogeyman to fight. Arisaka. Huh. You're funny. Got no idea who you are. What you supposed got to do? Got life you did. But you got exactly no idea what to do with it. Honestly, don't differ a bit from those poor bastards handcuffed to the feeders in their mega block pads. Okay. I'll tell you why I want to destroy Arisaka, but I'll only tell you once. Want to hear it? Yeah, go on. All right. Go on then. I saw a corpse strip farmers of water and eventually of land. Saw them transform Night City into a machine fueled by people's crushed spirits, broken dreams, and empty pockets. Corpses have long controlled our lives, taken lots. And now they're after our souls. <laughs> don't exaggerate. Come on, don't exaggerate. V, I sit like an asshole. I've declared war not because capitalism's a thorn in my side or out of nostalgia for an America gone by. This war's a people's war against a system that spiraled out of our control. It's a war against the fucking forces of entropy. Understand? Do whatever it takes to stop them, defeat them, gut them. If I gotta kill, I'll kill. If I need your body, I'll fucking take it. Sounds familiar. Fucking hell. You still don't see it, but you will one day. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't, Johnny. Isn't Takamura oh, up there? Shit. Oh boy. Ah. Oh. Okay, okay. Whew. Got two levels. Time to get some more body. Look at that big palm.
Oh, reduce recoil and firing behind cover. Did I get that? Cool. Alright, now we just gotta... I want to do this quest. These boots are made for walking. Are you approaching me? Get off. Is this a car for sale? 49 grand, Jesus Christ. All these cars are so expensive. Uh, so a kilometer away. And I've got Scorpion's bike. Can I have quick travel there? Oh, it's really close by. Okay. Well, let's sort this thing out. Can you imagine if my own bike ran me over? That would be hilarious. Hello? I don't... I've been thinking a lot of things. Um... Da -da 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 -da. Mid Scorpion fat family had lost left adopting. I don't know. It'd be this fucking complicated. Uh, I don't get what's happening to me. I'm in the city. Feel free, free to do whatever. Uh, am I really free? Does that make sense? Maybe Mitch is right. You should go back. Settle everything once and for all. You'll see, don't worry. Anyway. I love the do you. Either that or that's just garbage. I love the sound that this bike makes. It's pretty far away. This husband I'm of yours. Who your husband is? Actually, who are you? I'd rather not discuss details over the phone. Please meet with us. We'll explain everything. As I said, it's a rather delicate matter. Why call me? Why call me of all people? Any particular reason? You came recommended. By who? I'd rather not say. Not over the phone. Is there any way we could meet? Discuss some details? Sure. Sure. Let's do that. I'll send you the address. See you. Let's go racking up all these side quests. But is that my old car? Oh, been a damn long while, old friend. Hmm. Let's see what we got here. Scan. Fenders and trunk eaten away by rust. The rest of the body's still holding up. Wonder what's under the hood. Look at the all right, lift the bonnet. It's warm. Engine was running just a short while ago. Hmm. New coil. Plugs. Somebody's clearly been tinkering with the camshaft. What's this now? Check the oil pan. Huh. New, but used. Salvage from some other junker. Someone cleaned the cooling fan. Filled up the brake fluid. Except... Huh. With water. Alright. Seen enough. Alright. Hey, what the... Hands off my car! Hello? The, what? No, it's my car. No? Why would you leave it rusting in a yard? It broke down. Because it broke down, and I... And you abandoned it, and now, out of nowhere, you remembered you'd left it. Likely story. 
Is this supposed to be a lot of PS? Yo, okay. You know what? Should have started with the step. Should have with the step motor. Should have started with the step motor. Would have been quicker. Says who? And why? Because it's iffy. It starts sticking. Clear the carbon deposits, and it starts running like new again. Fuck! I replaced the entire throttle. Ah, oh, see. Damn, her arms look sick. Takes the owner to really know a set of wheels. Former owner. Cause mine now. As soon as I'm done doing the basic fixes, I am leaving this fucking city in a cloud of exhaust. Buy a car off you. I'll buy this car off you. Pay enough so you can get another. But it, it's a wreck. It's my oh, car. My damn wreck. Come on. Take the cash before I change my mind. Jeez. Thanks. I'm not sure what to say. <laughs> so give it a think. While I take this baby for a ride. Get in my old car. Oh yeah. I like clockwork. Can I shoot him? Well, definitely no guy or girl magnet. But seems healthy and way too close to me, Johnny. Don't know the half of it. Wait till I open her up. Not afraid you might. Nah, what can it hurt? I'm dead anyway. Floor it, V. Just sitting there. Now, is it possible to shoot these the YouTuber NPCs? That it is not. Okay, sick. Well, glad to know. That's my shitter. All right. I think we've got plenty to do for the rest of the day. Um, clock's ticking. Metamorphosis and reputation. You know what? My Night City reputation is the least of my concerns right, right about now. So what's going to happen is that I am going to... Ooh, I fought the law in the law one. Alright. You know what? Let's do a little bit of side quests. There are a few. I'm not, I'll do all these gigs very high. Jeez, I'm not doing that yet. Let's do this gig. Let's, let's go fight the law, and then we'll sort those two main stories. All right? All right.